Do you use a RASA or even a Hyperstar? More particularly, do you use a cooled astronomy camera? If so, you might want to stick around and see what happened to me when I was trying to take my calibration frames. So while taking the dark images, this little half moon red circle kept showing up at the bottom of all my images and I couldn't figure out why. So I tried taking the darks in the middle of the night inside the shop here um, with all the lights turned off, everything taped up, covered up, and it was still there. So then um, I've heard some people say to just take the camera itself and screw in the cap the, the dust cap just had the camera sitting all by itself and do the darks that way. And then some people say, take the uh, darks hooked to your telescope, connect it to the image train just as it is, as you were gonna image and just close everything up. Um, with the cap on, no issues. With it hooked to the image train, that's when I had the issues. Now, um, if anybody knows the proper way or the best way, please um, put it down in the comments below and tell me which way you prefer to do yours. But either way, um, let me know and then watch this short, short video and you'll see what the fix was and what the issue was uh, and how I found out that issue of this mysterious red light in my darks. So here is the camera mounted on the front of the telescope. And if you notice, you should be able to see that red power light. I'm trying to point to it right here. That little red power light is something I did not account for. And that's been the root of all of my evil. It's been the root of the problem and taking the calibration frames. So what I've done is, is I've taken a piece of, a simple piece of um, electrical tape Just stuck over it like that. And that fixed the problem. Now my calibration frames are coming out pretty good so far. That little bit of light is what was throwing everything off. I haven't seen anybody mention that in any of the videos. I figured a red light wouldn't hurt it at all. But in fact, on the dark frames, it was killing my dark frames that would leave in this half circle of red light on one side of the frames. Thank you for watching this short video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to leave your comments about how you like to take your dark images. Until next time, clear skies.